everyone today we are going to understand section 87a and how it is going to give an income tax relief to the low income taxpayers in india well welcome to my channel and today we will throw light on this important section which everyone wants to know so if you're looking to understand how the rebate under the section 87a works this video is for you but before we dive in don't forget to like share and subscribe to our channel for more insightful content. Well, Section 87A of the Indian Income Tax Act was introduced to provide tax relief to low-income taxpayers. It's a rebate system which aims to ease the financial burden on individuals with a limited income. Now, this will also encourage tax compliance. Now, let's take a closer look at the eligibility criteria and how the rebate is calculated. Well, I'll give you the example as of September 2021. As per the Section 87A rebate, it is applicable for individual taxpayers with net taxable income up to rupees 5 lakh per annum. Now, tax laws are subject to change, and that's why I've given you the month and the year, September 2021, the date on which this income tax rebate is applicable. Now, the maximum rebate amount under Section 87A is rupees 12,500 or the total tax payable, whichever is lower. So, let's see how to calculate the rebate. Let's first determine your total tax liability based on the applicable tax slabs. Then apply the rebate of 12,500 or whatever the tax payable, whichever is lower. Now this will give you the final tax liability after the rebate. So let me give you a very good and a simple example. Let's suppose you have a net taxable income of rupees 4.5 lakhs. Now based on your tax slab, your total tax liability would be rupees 10,000. Now, since the total tax payable 10,000 is less than the maximum rebate amount of 12,500, you would be eligible for a rebate of 10,000. This means you will not pay any tax. Your final tax liability after the rebate would be zero. And that's how you calculate rebate under Section 87A of the Indian Income Tax. Now, this tax relief is for low-income taxpayers. Keep in mind that tax laws are subject to change. So, always consult a tax professional or the Income Tax Department of India's official website for the most up-to-date information. Now, if you found this video helpful, please give us up a thumbs up and share it with your friends and family. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more informative content. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video.